Hello everybody, Ginger Shader here, and welcome back to another episode of Dragon Block Save with me. So, since last episode, last episode isn't actually like the 30 like goal kind of yet, but I'm not sure it will be by the end of this. But by the time I put this episode, I'm sure it will be. Get every faith in y'all to hit the like button. Um, but yeah, welcome back everybody. So, that guy's doing something weird. Okay. Oh yeah, so my house has been infested with guards, as you can see there's another one here. I don't know why they must be respawning after the Hydra killed them all, and they're just they decide they're gonna respawn in my house. So yeah, I've got a bunch of them here. I really hate it. I've already killed several of them. Um, I did a little upgrade. The roof is not an upgrade. The roof looks like roof looks like total crap. I'll be honest. But yeah, the little house next door, I went and kind of renovated along with the garden and just kind of put a little bit outside it just so that the children have more places to go, and the guards hopefully will stay out of my sight. You. <laughs> There's no children around. I can kill you now, you son of a bitch. Ha ha ha! Oh look, he's furious. He's seething. Minus 42. Oh my god. The hell do you think you're doing? I really do hate it. They keep dancing on my daughter Ginger's grave. They have no idea how much this infuriates me. Yeah, see? Didn't like that, did you? Alright, anyway, the plans for today. Well, first of all, as far as upgrades goes, I actually... Well, I'm at 27 um, training points. I actually got the dash skill, which I've upgraded already to level 7, because it is fairly cheap, so I'm a lot quicker, because I've, you know, I've got a need for speed. I like going quick. Um, the As far as the story goes, I'm at the Ganyu Force part, so I've got that to do. Um, I gathered up all the lapis that I got from the Twilight, I believe, last time, and I'm actually going to use that right now. I'm going to renov... Not renov... I'm going to power up my scythe. Now, my scythe doesn't have any more of those little things that lets me do more stuff. What they call modifiers, that's it. But if I take a notch apple and a diamond block, I can get our modifier. There we are, so now I'm going to add lapis to this. So I'm sure this will go well. 40 blocks, and I couldn't even get the full amount from it. 360 that was, so I've still got another 10 blocks I need to get of lapis. Now I actually find out this is full armor set on the way it is. Apparently the trousers actually do matter. See, if you give... I'll just... I'll, it's easier to show you rather than just say it to you. If I take like the battle armor leggings, like they look cooler, and I put them on, I actually lose a full a one bit and I think a half or just one bit of armor rating. So apparently the armor that you haven't actually put any coloring on, that's actually stronger than all the other armor. Which I never knew, so that was quite weird. And I just noticed there inside my little bag here, I've got some diamond stuff to take apart. So let's get to that as well. There we are, good way to start the episode, 13 diamonds. It's always a nice way. Alright, so, so far, when I asked everyone if you wanted to take a vote on which Twilight boss I fight against next, so far the only one that's been voted for is the Night Thing, which is what I'm going to keep calling it because I don't know its actual name. So, right now that's the only one people have, you know, voted for. That's the only one that's in the running. So, if any of you want to see me fight the Urgas Ministrum, make sure you vote for it. Make sure you leave a comment saying that's what you want me to fight next because there will be the next episode the episode after I'll actually go and do it. For this episode, I plan to take on the Genu Force, for one thing. Um, I also want to go and have a look at the dinosaurs, because I'm, I want to see how s Oh, there's a zombie there. And there's a guard here, and the guard has went to sleep. Ooh! Ooh, that's the other thing. That's it. Um, I found a good use for these guards while I was, um... Well, I was just kind of playing around. I discovered, right, well, they're a real pain in the ass. They keep respawning. I don't know what I can do with them. Then I had an ingenious idea. I can hire them. And special, hire, and I can hire them for one full hour. It actually counts as one full hour our time, as long as I'm in the game. If I leave, then I think I lose it. Okay, you're hired. Now follow me. I swear to God, if you're asleep. Wake up! I just get, I just hired you not for you to sleep for half an hour. Now come on, let's go. Oi! Right, you are following me, good. Alright, follow me. Yeah, there we are. Okay, so I discovered, if I have a little look inside the old black book here. Okay, there's different types of alloys. One of them requires blood. Um, where is it? Pig iron requires iron, blood, and emerald. Now, I don't know how, but some emerald managed to get inside here. Like, there it is down there. It's like a fourth of an ingot. I don't know how the heck it got in there, but it is. And it's sort of worrying, because... I really don't understand. Oh yeah, I've got 214 gold as well. 
Um, yeah, there's that in there. I've also got a tiny bit of blood in there as well because I jumped in. Now, I discovered if I fly away up here, because this is so high up, the guard has to teleport to me to keep following me. So the guard will naturally teleport up here. Yep, there we go. For God's sake. Right, now if I fly down here... Oh, no, wait, no, no. No! Come back! Come up here! That is a twat. Right, dive in. Go on. Now, if I fly down with them... There we are. All right, now he'll just chill in there every so often. He should. Yep, there we go. He starts getting hurt. He starts losing blood. And I start getting blood, which is even better. So I don't know if I can access the controls from inside here. Oh, it's not putting the blood thing up. What? That's disappointing. Oh, no, it's giving me emeralds. Oh, yeah, these guys count as villagers. So if I leave this guard in here, he'll keep giving me emeralds. Ah! This is such a good idea. I finally found a use for these useless pieces of crap. Alright. Now, stay. You stay there. I'm going to fly away and get the others. Special higher. Higher. You're hired as well, my friend. Alright, both of you follow me. I've got a really special job. Oh, well, there's another one. Okay, special higher. Right, you're hired too. Okay, three of you. I've got a really, really special, important job for you. Is the other guy still alive? Oh, no, he's dead. I swear to God. Follow me. Okay, where's the other ones? I've got to make them follow me. Okay. I need you all to come up here. Come on up. There we are. Right, then dive in here. Go on. Right, there's one in. Right, you need to now stay there. Okay, right. All right, we've got another one up here. Okay. Right. In you go. In, in you go. There we are. All right. If this was a lot smaller, this would be so much easier. Right, now you stay there and give me all your emerald encrusted blood. Right, where's the other one? Oh, hello, there you are. All right. All right, dive in. For God's sake. In you go. Oh, my. In. In. There we are. That's three of them. Oh, one just died. Never mind, there's two of them. Oh, hey, stand still. I want to make you stay so I, don't have to, I can fly away. Stop following right now. Stay. That's good. You three just, you two just stay in there. Oh, there's another one. Another one for hire. All you need to do now, my friend, is just drop in there. There you are. Right, and then and if you just stand there and give me all your blood, that would be great. I'm surprised he's still alive. He's surviving a lot longer than the other ones. Wait, see, maybe, maybe he's a boss villager with the regen ability. If that's the case, that's an infinite amount of Emerald, look, that's already four emeralds I've gotten from them. Wonderful. Unfortunately, in order to make these damn pig ingots, I've got to jump in as well and donate my blood to the cause, so I need to dive into. Okay, are you actually... You're still at full health. How on earth are you still at full health? Are You're really regenerating really quick, aren't you? Or are you just not taking damage? No, you are taking damage. You are. I've got, I've got five emeralds worth. Emerald ingot. That'll be interesting. Alright, that's quite good. I found a really rare find. I found a guard that cannot be killed because he regens quicker than he gets damaged. So, I just need to keep hiring this guy and I'll get an infinite source of emeralds. I'm a genius. I am an absolute genius. I'm sure no one else thought about this before me. Surely. Is there a way I can... I don't think there's any other way I can get blood in this because I can't ride any... I suppose I could ride an animal in here. That would work. I wonder, can I get, can I leash an animal and bring it in here? Let's find out. Can make a name tag? Since when is that a bloody thing? I'm pretty sure you can't make name tags. It must be one of the mods allows you to make it. That's magic. Makes life a lot simpler. Okay, right, so I can use this blue gelatinous slime in order to get what I want. So I want a leash and I want to find the nearest animal, preferably a piggy maybe. And from there, I'm going to see if I can drop it in that smelter. And I know, yep, there's a pig right there. I knew there was one really close by. Okay. Hello, friend. Hello. Want to follow me now? Let's go. I wonder what happens when you drop. All right, this pig's going to die insanely quick. That's the only problem. But I just want to test it. Will I get blood from a pig? Oh, better, better fly you over. Okay, right. Over you come. Oh, God. Right. 
Put you down nice and gentle. Maybe a bit gentler than that. Well, damn. Okay, well, the, the experiments discovered a few issues. Um, I don't quite know what to do about this. Ah, yes, my daughter. Hello. Hello, wifey. Alright, come forth. Right, I better actually take her in here. There we are. Right. Stay. Ah, it's Sakura. Okay. Um, Sakura, set home. Sakura, move. There you are. You're free to go. She's very colourful. She's a very colourful girl. Um, wife, I'll wait till night time. I'll make some more babies with you. Oh my god, so much emerald. Um, can I make an emerald ingot? Is that a thing in this? I don't think it's a thing. I'm interested to find out though. Let's give it a go. No, it's not a thing. Okay. I wonder. Can I summon the Genu Force in there and let them bleed out to give me blood? Now this is quite dangerous, I thought, because if they spawn and they spawn around the area, they could potentially spawn in my house or something. Maybe I should wait until it's a singular boss that I know I can beat. Maybe better. A oh, good day to you too, um, emerald bag blood donator thing. Ah, oh, so many emeralds. I'm guessing the only way I can like, get the emeralds out is using an emerald block, which is just nine, so that's pretty simple. It seems like a pretty easy idea to me. Yeah, I mean, that's perfect. So I've got an infinite source of emeralds, unless that guard despawns and disappears. I'm certain more guards will spawn as time goes, because they always seem to respawn in my house, so I can just get more emeralds off them. I really need to figure out a better way to get blood, though. That's still my thing. I'm not sure how I should do that. Okay, so I still need to unlock my potential. You just missed so badly, my friend. Um, and get my endurance perks. Oh, you dick. Right, when I was dropping my way down. Ow. God damn you, cat. 9.0 emeralds. Ah, uh, it's such a good source. Damn it. This damn iron ingots aren't done yet. Oh yeah, another thing was, everyone, or not everyone, some people keep saying, you need to go to Master's Ro Master Roshi's so you can learn, like, certain techniques off him and things like that. The only problem is, I've had a really hard time locating his house. Because, now I'm quite worried about this, is, as we've seen, Planet Namek's um, area is on this map and it shouldn't be because we know planet Namek you're supposed to use the space bar to get to so it's very possible that the thing has glitched out and I'm no longer able to find Master Ocean because of that but I'm going to give it a go trying to find him I know he normally spawns in an ocean biome and it's normally nearby Kami's most of the time unless it glitches yeah it's normally fairly close by it's normally quite findable so I reckon I should at least give it a try okay so there we go so I actually was told do slash help I think it was three or something they said, but there's like 19 extra pages because of all the mods that are in. So, if I do dra slash DBC locations, it tells me the location of one core in Kami's Tower, then came house. It says not explored yet. It can be found in an ocean biome. So I was right on that part. It is an ocean biome, which we all know Master Roshi's house was going to be anyway. So, I suppose I'll have a little gander and try and find them, but I can't promise I will find them because I don't even know who's actually loaded in this map, which is a real damn shame. I really would like to see if he is, and more than likely he is a boss as well, because unfortunately, bloody Kami and Korn have both been bosses so far, so fairly confident he will be too, which will be a real pain. Alright, we're in a ocean biome right now, so there's a chance we'll see his little head popping about somewhere, but I wouldn't hold my breath, and I'm going to try going this way, because I don't remember going this way in the ocean before. I have flew up that way, when I did search for him previously. Now, I've never found Master Roshi's house before, so I don't know what it looks like. Um, I honestly don't know if there's any trick to finding him, or if it's just kind of potluck, so you just keep having a look around and see. Also, I was wrong. I said before only the night thingy had been voted for. I was wrong. Some, one person voted for the Your Gas as well, so Your Gas is in the running as well at the moment. But again, if anyone wants, whatever, you know, we've got three Twilight bosses left for me to fight. We've got the Minish Room. Which, until I get the portable hole little wand tip thing, I don't really feel like going and fighting with that thing. Because it'd be a pain to get in and out of the maze. Um, there's a your gas tower, which I can actually do the tower legit without flying. Because I can just turn my fly ability off. Because I can just, well, make it so that the button doesn't work. So I can't actually fly. I've just got to jump everywhere. Of course, I don't take fall damage, so it wouldn't matter anyway. Um, and then there's the night thing. I don't know its proper name for. So yeah, there's those three, so if you want to see me fight any of them, just leave a comment and say which one it is you want me to fight. 
then when it comes to around to that time, I'll just tally up the votes and see what comes up. Okay, so imagine Kane House is going to look like the actual house out of Dragon Ball Z or something similar. Because like when you go to King Kai's place, that looks somewhat like King Kai's actual planet, although it's flat and not round. But you know, Minecraft's flat world; it's a square world, so it makes sense that that changed a little bit. But yeah, it looks somewhat similar to it. I reckon I'll see it on the map the second it's supposed to show up. Show up should make things easier and I found a really large ocean biome so I should be able to find it quite it should be here I reckon it should be here I don't know if you can only get one ever spawn in but I reckon it should be around this ocean because it's the closest ocean you're going to get to Kami's lookout okay so I found more Namek biome that's great um yeah this is this is all pretty glitched I'm fairly far away from the tennis point nearly a thousand blocks and I'm finding more Namek biomes kind of spawning in, mixing with, I think it's a desert biome. Just, my god, my god. This does not fill me with confidence looking for ca um, Master Roshis, I'm going to be honest with you. I don't know, it might be a lost cause trying to find this guy because he's, uh, I don't even know if he, I don't think he actually spawns in, to be honest. Could be wrong, it would help if I had other people searching for him. Had more eyes and ears about if I could like shadow clone myself, that would be great. But yeah, just trying to locate them off the ocean by yourself. Ocean's a big place, and Master Roshi's is a fairly small island. Although it looks like a very beautiful island, and it would stand out amongst anywhere. It's still finding it seems to be quite tricky, or it will be quite tricky if I do find them. And I went and checked up YouTube. I could not see any guides on how to locate them. If there's any way to special look at them. I don't know if I can like check maybe the configs and things in my Dragon Block C file bit for on the server. I don't know if there's something I can check on now that will tell me the location of them to make this a little bit easier, but I don't think there is. Which is unfortunate. Okay, just while I'm on the road home actually, I just thought of some really interesting news as well. Now I went on the Dragon Block C website, and the creator whatever he does videos on things, but he hadn't done a video on this newest update that he's done. It's not really a full update, it's more, he's released a test version, it's unstable for Dragon Block C in 1.7.10. So, that was really big to me, even though it, it involves no new stuff, it's still the exact same as what I've got on here. There's no extra added bits, but it's on 1.7.10, which means there's a whole new variety of mods that can get added with it, because 1.7.10 is quite popular thing for mods. He is, is still actually in there, oh my god. But he is actually now not regening quicker than he's taking damage. So, we're about to say goodbye to this little filler. He got me a good nine odd emeralds out of, out of you. It was quite nice of you. Molten iron. Wait, I put three... <gasps> Pig iron! We've got some! Not enough though. For the love of God, they've respawned and are doing this game again. Why do they always respawn? Why do they feel the need to dance on my daughter's grave? There's two of them now! You taking the mick? Oh no! You sons of bitches! Okay, I'll take- I'll- I'll rumble with all yous. Get out of here. Get out of here, punks. Dear, touch my daughter's grave. Oh my god. There's monsters! That guard has died as well, god damn it. Uh, what? I will go full power, I will transform into my predator form, and I will rip you a new one. You think I'm joking? I'll do it. Oh yeah, now that I enter my predator form, now he's run away. Punks. Okay, so I've just fenced this area in. You just now have no escape. I'm in my predator form. I feel like both of you need to die. Very painful deaths. Alright, well, I'm, since I'm in this form and I'm ready to fight, I might as well actually get real opponents out, so let's invite the old, again you Foss, for a little rumble. One of them's a boss! Oh, alright, hello. Right, so Gildo only has 8,000 per level. Which one's coming towards me? Which one? All of you want to fight! Oh god, my, oh god, my health. Oh god. Ow! Bugger. I didn't go as planned. Alright, unfortunately because I did- Oh god. Ow, that actually hit. Oh god. Alright, fly away. I think he's got an even bigger power boost because he's- Oh god. 
Oh god, that is quite scary. Alright, I'm gonna take care of Jace first, because he's not even meant to be fighting right now. I swear to god, he's got an even- Raccoon's got an even bigger power boost. He has! Jace just hit me, it did not nearly as much damage as what Raccoon's did. Raccoon, because he's when it's a special boss, he's getting extra power. Ow! Ow, 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 I have no idea where Burters went. Um, I do know I need to put that fire out though. Oh god. Ah ha ha ha! No thank you, no thank you indeed. Alright. Ah ha ha! My god, they do so much damage! Oh ho ho, I can't beat them. If I can, it's going to take me a little while. Alright, screw the Ginyu Force, I'm not doing it. I've died too many times now. I can't do it. Ow. Alright, I need to. I know what I need to do though. I need to get an energy attack. It's a different thing. I really feel like I should waste these guys though, just because they're here and I'm, I'm not going to go away. But Raccoon hit, beats me in three hits. Oh, but maybe I can beat... Nope, 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 Jace helped him. God damn it, Jace, why couldn't you just wait your turn? And he was a boss. Who would have thought it? Look at all them death points. I need to take out Jace next, because he's actually still weakened greatly. So, you need to die. Oh, he's attack missed, bro. Alright, where's Berta? Berta, you're next. Ow. Quite a lot of damage. He poison. Oh no, he's a boss as well. Ow. The poison. Poison hearts. Then sipping again. Alright, kill time. A diamond chest plate out of it. That's nice. Um. Never for the boss. I don't believe I got two boss ones out of that. Two boss bosses. What are the odds? Alright, can you just don't fire any energy attack? Don't fire any energy attacks at me, please. I need to fly away. Alright, what I need to do is, as soon as he hits an energy attack, or flat fires one, I need to then go straight and attack him. And I've got a couple of hits in. And fly away again. So he doesn't hit me with another. Ah, uh, Neil, no, you don't. I could probably get five in. Yep, finish him! Got him. Ah, oh, 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 did it. I need to fight them again. Bugger. That's... Very inconvenient. Because they are much stronger than I am. I'm quite glad I didn't summon them in here now. My god, if I'd summon them in here. Are you serious? My own private home away from home and you've got to invade here as well. My god, I get no privacy in this place whatsoever. At least I got some diamonds out of that. That's good at least. Um, Didn't get much else out of it other than a lot of death points. I mean, that was quite a few there. I swear to God, I'm going to murder all these guys. But if I do, they just respawn. It's never ending. It's never ending. Okay, so what I've learned from that. One, I need a really powerful energy attack that I can fire at them from a distance. Two, I need a lot more health. Three, I need to be a lot more smart and be prepared for boss fights because they seem to be a lot stronger. So one, two, three, four, five, six deaths. Seven deaths. Is it seven? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seven deaths. And again, you force very short periods of time in between them. God damn it. Oh, yeah, that's better. All the death points removed. Alrighty, so I think before I started fighting with the Ginyu Force, I was talking about a little bit about the updated 1.7.10 version. Although it's unstable, it's actually playable, and I actually tried playing it with a bunch of mods and it actually worked. So I don't know. Once I mean inevitably, inevitably this part of the series is gonna end at some point because I'm gonna run out of things to do at one point or another. At which point then 1.7.10 will be really appealing because then I can add extra mods in that I can't get in 1.6.4 um, uh, form. Saying that word, saying 4 form is not easy, or those words. Um, so yeah, once I believe this part of this series, of, once I've killed all the bosses, once I've done everything I believe I can get out of this, and I want to take a little break until 1.7.10 is finished, I was trying to think of what other types of series I could do in between, just as like a kind of gap filler before 1.7.10 gets finished because he has actually he's updated it twice already the unstable version so he is working on it and it is somewhat playable but I wouldn't want to use the unstable version until he says it's it's good to go so some ideas that came to mind there's two other mods out there 
for separate animes that they don't really work too well together, but separately they work really well. Now I've already done Bleach, I've already done a crap load of Bleach, so I would leave that for the now. But mods I haven't tried, I haven't used the One Piece mod before, where I've went off to try and be a pirate and, you know, get the... Well, I would say the One Piece, but when it comes to Lucky Blocks, there's no such thing as a One Piece, because Lucky Block spawns everything. No, but you can get all the Devil Fruits, the Devil Fruits are fun, and that would be fun to play on a server, I reckon, so... There's the One Piece mod, there's also the Naruto mod, not the one in this. A completely separate one, that runs on Chakra, its own Chakra system, on the le top left-hand side of your screen as well. Um, but it's like a full body one. You get things like running on water as possible. It does a cool animation for when you're running. So like your hands go behind you like an actual ninja. It looks really freaking cool. And tie that in. I can also then put in with those ones. Phone put simple 10. I can put on the extra dungeons mod. Which gives me then a whole new bunch of bosses to fight as well. So if I decide to do one of those two series. I would want to ask everyone, which one of those series would you prefer me doing? Would you prefer seeing a One Piece themed series or a Naruto themed series? Just as kind of like a go-between until Dragon Block C gets updated more. Now, I'm not saying this is going to happen right now, because it's I've still got a bit more of this to go. But it's just for when this is inevitably done, and I'm going to upgrade to 1.7.10 when this version's out. Would you prefer seeing a Naruto series or One Piece series? That's just a question. Just as like a little go-between series. Nothing that's going to be like super long-lasting. Dragon Block C is like the main thing to do right now. I'm a having a lot of fun with this, so I want to keep this going for as long as I possibly can. But you know, there's the question for you: Would you rather see a Naruto series or a One Piece theme series next after 1.6.4 is done and before the 1.7.10 version comes out? <laughs> so much to think about. Anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode here. I've sort of just get get a bit carried away there with the Naruto One Piece thing. But yeah, I'm um, ending this episode here. I hope you've all enjoyed the show. Got my ass handed to me by the Ginyu Force, which was nice. Um, I'll need to try and extract revenge on them next time. And I'll need to try and ma find Master Roshi's place, so still got tons to do. But anyway, guys, be sure to hit that like button if you enjoyed the show. Hit the, I'll leave the like goal thing at 30 likes, so if you want to get the next episode out early, like within the next one, two days, just hit the like button and you'll get the episode early. So there's that. Uh, be sure to leave some comments on one being what would you like the next series to be, whether it's Naruto or One Piece. If, you've, you know, if you know what those animes are, you might think, well, that... A One Piece one sounds really cool, they get the Devil Fruits, or a Naruto one, where I, I'm a ninja, that sounds really cool. You know, if you think you'd prefer to see one of them, be sure to leave it in the comments. And, yeah, everyone you can still vote on which Twilight boss I take on next. So we've got the Night Thing, we've got the Urgas, we've got the Ministrum. Really, the Ministrum, no one ever votes for that, so it's really just a battle between the Urgas and the Night Thing. So, whichever one you want me to fight next, just leave a comment down below, saying so. And also keep suggesting names for my children. I know I didn't make any children today, but I was busy donating blood and having guards donate blood and things like that. So I was a bit busy today, but I'll be making more children next time. Anyway, guys, thank you all for watching. See you all next time. Goodbye, everybody.